and that was uh, along together. I'm going to show you the very last run on D minor. So this is another of my famous five fingers runs. So it's uh, based on D minor with the, the major six, uh, B natural, the major seven and the nine. So three, five, six, seven, major seven and nine. So never forget that uh, when you play a minor tune, in this case in D minor, uh, you have two wonderful notes to take into consideration in the tonic D minor, that is the major six and the major seven. notes uh, are uh, extremely beautiful you know and I say that because uh, 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 I hear very often students uh, that whenever they are in tonic uh, they have the tendency to abuse uh, the minor seven C natural that there is nothing wrong with that, but uh, I think uh, C sharp, the major seven and the major six, uh, are two uh, really characteristic notes that we can use. Yeah, and then, uh, you know, before the bridge, the tune resolves uh, to D major. So here is another five finger runs that fits uh, right under your fingers. So I start from the six of D, so B natural with the thumb, and then C sharp, E, F sharp, A. And remember as to, you have to try to make it sound as much as possible to a glissando. thing in this tune you know for those of you who know the song very well you might be accustomed to play this uh, harmonic solution right here so B minor 7 to G as to E7 to G minor 7. Well, according to the, uh, uh, the Barry Harris suggestion that uh, sometimes uh, we need to get away of two fives, two fives, two fives. Uh, music is not only two fives. But there is another beautiful resource that uh, we should try to engage uh, more often that is the diminished and with the, the potential of the diminished and so instead of playing B minor 7 to E7 that resolves uh, to G minor 7 you can play a G sharp diminished so that G sharp diminished uh, resolves uh, to G minor 7, C7 to F, so, and so please pay attention to the way that I voice it. I stretch uh, a tenth in the left hand, G 
sharp F B and then uh, with the thumb I play together E and F G sharp B D flat E Of course, these, uh, these are uh, <coughs> just, uh, 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 just hints, you know, very little thing, because if you listen to, again, I have to mention Art Tatum and Errol Garner, really, then you have uh, the idea of the amazing uh, quantity of possibilities that can be disclosed within one song you know so I think it's uh, it's up to us uh, as piano player as uh, jazz lovers to find our own way to dig out this thing and to make them our own that's exactly it. You gotta make them your own. 